A confrontation on campus has left Muslim students at Wayne State University fearing for their safety. Thank you for staying with us. I'm Brian Abel. And I'm Glenda Lewis. They say a group of people holding Islamophobic signs did something deeply disturbing. Now they're calling on the university to take action. 7 Action News reporter Faraz Javid spoke with students and has the university's reaction. This video showing the moments leading up to what Muslim students are calling an act of hate. Members of a religious group known to travel the country targeting people of other faiths on campus of Wayne State holding anti-Semitic signs, but what happened next left students feeling not only deeply offended, but fearful for their safety. One of them grabbed the Quran, slammed it on the floor and started stomping on it. The Quran is the holy book of Islam. Desecration of it is considered by Muslims as an act of hate. Mahmoud Mohaisen, a philosophy student, grabbed the Quran from one of the men, but he says the hate didn't end there. They called us devil worshippers, and they called us ignorant and arrogant and prideful. So you went to the dean, what did the dean say? We can't do anything about it because it's a public university. I reached out to Wayne State for comment, but they say their hands were tied due to free speech. In an official statement to 7 Action News, WSU writes, While the First Amendment covered last week's actions, we find this to be deplorable, repulsive, and worthy of our strongest condemnation. The group notified the university ahead of time that it was coming to speak on campus and our police department provided a strong presence to ensure that the campus remains safe for everyone. But Mahmoud doesn't believe that statement coincides with past events. What past events are you referring to? Two years ago, a group of uh, far-right individuals came and they had swastika windmills and they said that uh, green energy is just as effective as Ashkowitz. This is the email the dean sent out following that incident. The university condemned the action, and Wayne State University police removed the group from campus. Mahmoud also condemns the anti-Semitic signage, but he wants the university to take similar action with this group and other instigators. Meanwhile, another student, Zaina Jadalla, now feels unsafe on campus. This is a uh, campus that has a very wide majority of Muslims, and it's in Ramadan in the last nights. A regular statement would have been something that they could have initially done, and open dialogue, talk to us, make sure that we're safe and we feel safe and we feel welcome. They say that they want a diverse community, but this doesn't allow for growth for diversity. Now, after digging for answers just moments ago, the university did send out an email condemning the Islamic phobic incident and university officials will also be meeting Muslim students on May 10th. Reporting in Detroit, I'm Faraz Javid, 7 Action News.